Whoa. But other than that, guys, welcome to Nebraska. A game. <laughs> a horror game set in Nebraska or something like that. I don't know. Here we go, guys. Let's begin. Oh, what's that? Yeah, horror game in Nebraska. I don't know. That's such a weird name for a game. <laughs> Dev's all like, oh, I can't come up with anything good. Let's just use that. In 2020, Wait, what? for my journalism, I was exploring the rural areas of Nebraska for a book I'm writing about the strange and undocumented parts of Midwest America. As I was driving around rural Nebraska, the cold snow was freezing the interior of my car like the inside of a fridge. I was keenly aware that my fuel meter had been sitting on E for the last couple of miles. Adding to the problem, I hadn't seen any sign of civilization for hours. As the car slowly rolled to an inevitable stop in the unforgiving rural Midwest, I noticed something far in the distance. It was some kind of building covered by the sea of snow and trees that surrounded it. In a desperate attempt for help and sheer curiosity, I ran down the road until I reached the uncanny structure. The building had an entrance with a wide, grinning mouth painted around the door that had faded away, caused by the harsh conditions and test of time. I pushed on the door and was amazed to hear the sound of the door squeak slowly open. I stepped in and cracked my glow stick to illuminate the darkness of the room. Glow in stick? between the midst of empty boxes and rotting wood, ah, flashlight. there was a sign above the unattended cashier stand which read, Welcome to the House of Horrors. At this moment, it was clear this was a Halloween attraction of some sort that had been abandoned. Unsure of when or how long it had been abandoned for, and left with no other option, I began to explore, pressing a button behind the cashier stand which opened a door to the start of the attraction's experience. When I stepped in fully, there was a loud buzz and the sound of the door slamming behind me. I was trapped. Nebraska. Oh, creepy name, huh, guys? It's like Ohio. <laughs> All right, here we go, guys. Nebraska. Whoa, what the hell? Thank you for coming to the attraction. Whoa. We hope you enjoyed this automated experience. Whoa. Enjoy this automated experience. What the hell? Huh? Whoa, this game was impressive, though. Yeah, this isn't too, too much of a well-known game, actually. Uh, should I do it? I don't know. Well, let me add some stuff first. All right, hopefully that's better. All right. But yeah, this isn't too much of a well-known game. It only has, has, I think the game only has like 60 or 50 reviews. So here we go, guys. Looks pretty impressive so far. The graphics too, man. Holy crap! Is it... the game runs pretty pretty well on my PC? It's not spinning away, my, you know, my fans like some games do. Oh, and he has like an eyeball showing you what to do here. Isn't that like similar to Amnesia? A metal cage containing what's like electrical wiring. I'm about to assume. I wonder why we would have labeled Russian characters in Midwest America. Contet, contet. I don't know what the the E thing is or the, the backwards N thing. Nair, pish. I don't know. Uh, but I know what this means. I know what this means. This is gas. 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 So it's like a gas thing. But why don't we like a tomb, bro? Left mouse button to open? Where's my glow stick? G? Whoa. Dang. This G. This this glow stick is brighter than some flashlights in some horror games, bro. <laughs> Dude. <laughs> Holy moly. So where are we going? Space bar to jump. And this game is pretty, I don't know, well designed so far, concerning how unknown it is. So it only has like a few reviews, like I said before. It came like, and I, I got this with, with a bundle with another game. I was watching it, you know, when, when the game came out, it was like, what, I don't know, 20 bucks or something, and it dropped down to like, I don't know, three or f five this summer sale. Uh, yeah, open this. Yeah, so far I'm liking it, you know? Spooky, I guess. Tab. Tab open inventory. Okay. Why do we have like a temperature thing here? Body temperature? Oh, that's for like outside. Alright. 
I lost this place in man for it. Mummy and many other things are stopped around them. The candles are still lit. Yeah, what? Mummies? This looks like a, 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 I don't know, like a tomb that would be in Skyrim, bro. <laughs> oh god, a plane going over it. Oh, wait, what? Real or not, looks like out of place to put these bones, so you start piling them on top of each other. What? Bones? What, you, what the hell do you mean? Why is this cage locked? Uh, what? Can I get in here? Oh, it's all locked. Uh oh. So, I have a crowbar that I hit back? I don't know. This doesn't seem like we're going the right way. So far, it's been telling us where to go. Oh, there's multiple paths here, right? Where did he come from? I don't know. We'll go this way. And are you in I mean, there's nothing there. Oh my god, let me turn up. Close my window. Man, I hear someone like revving her <laughs> water cycle outside. Alright, here we go. Rooted in my immersion here. Alright, here we go, guys. What is this? Open inventory and use some sort of tool. I have the crowbar. Alright, whoa. Holy crap. Yeah, so far the game's pretty cool. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Pretty impressive so far. Now we're in here. If you're on a better temperature, you can eventually die from hot hypothermia or heat stroke if you get too hot or cold. Whoa. Dang, look at this. The mechanics in the game, guys. So. What? Huh? What time is it? Looks like it's been a while since the clock last worked. Some kind of classroom and temple? Oh, that's not a Rome temple, bro. That's like the Tower of Babylon or something, right? Gosh, it's so loud, bro. Got a key. Huh? Huh? Power box was switched on. It still seems to be more intertwined than I previously believed. And it has like dust flying around too? Holy crap, dude, bro. So everything's on? Is that the crowbar? No, I don't. Whoa, we're at? Oh, I can't play the piano. It's strange how the only thing broken in this room is the cabinet. It seems like someone smashed it deliberately. Soup is mortal. It seems to be crap for some time. Looks like some catastrophic event happened before his faith became abandoned. So it's abandoned. Moldy soup. Oh, some key is strong. Locked it. Like there's nothing inside of it. Yeah, that's true. That's true. There's obviously a secret in here. Oh, yeah. Here we go, guys. Open the door. Yeah, open it up. A secret door. Holy moly. Whoa, calm down. Gosh. Every time you pick up something, it, it like jerks violently. Well, here we go. Wait, what? It just fell down. Hmm. But that's a pretty unique thing here. Mechanic of the game. Oh, what? Oh, hang on. I I had to lower it a little bit because I don't want my voice to be obscured by the game. Seems like yeah, the audio level's fine now. Shift or walking? What's over here? Can't move by hand. The wood's too strong. Well, let's squeeze through. Huh? Can't move anymore. Oh. Oh god, I'm getting cold. I'm shivering. What the hell? Is it a wall? I can't go any further? What? What's going on? <laughs> oh god, my body temperature's dropping, guys. 
What's going on? Here, we'll get out of this. Get out of this. Um. Barricade is shut. The tap turns on, but there's no water comes out. Likely someone before left this. Here before me left this for some reason. What if? However, if that were true, I would sort of be barricaded. I see. Still getting cold. Is that someone? Oh no, it's not. This is a pipe. This place is massive, though. Storage. Large toolbox, piece of paper attached to them, faded away from no causes making them re readable. Yeah, what? Oh. What's this? A hammer. Or probably for the, uh, the wood barricade. Wherever that is. Power? What's this? Health? Turns on, but no water comes out. Likely before it was here before it left me. What? what barricaded? Oh, I got a thing. Place this floodlight before the room light because the room light hasn't worked properly for some, some time. Wait, how's the game save though? Um, Alright, there we go. So where's this barricade at? Right, there's a something... I don't know, this place is massive though. I can't find my final... Okay, wait. Where was... Oh, right here. There we go. Gosh, that music though. I don't know how loud it is in OBS, but it's pretty loud, dude. Here, turn that music down. There we go, much better. <laughs> uh, what? A teleporter coming in here. Oh wait, right here. Let me open it. Anything else? No. Stop using an item to equip. Oh. So now I go under. Yeah, pretty cool game though. Not gonna lie for. Things unknown. Hmm. But we're. Is there a monster or something in here? <laughs> oh, wait, what? We're stuck down here? Okay. Gas. More rats? What is the thing? Whatever it is, since you're getting off heat, I can feel it through this window. Okay, so they're not dying of hypothermia anymore. That was that thing. Whoa. Hey, what? What is that thing? Temperature. Oh, temperature's going up. Looks similar to the one I saw just when they're just smaller. What are these things? The hell? Oh. Door lock. Yeah, the game is pretty graphically good too. Oh yes, the one doll. Oh, a hat. The Soviet logo. Oh dang, Soviet, Soviet uh, base in Nebraska. <laughs> Nebraska. It seems like it's is Soviet based on the hat and the different signs in Russian. How could this be so discontinued in 1991 as 2020? Yeah, what? Scientists, doctors live in this room? I just assume a regular person would have this much medicine sitting around. A Soviet base, secret base in America? Holy moly, guys. That's locked door. The 
Hell, a rat? That's yeah, about the rat. It's just dead here. So, wait. Don't see much else here. Anything else in the room I need to know about? No? Oh yeah, okay. It's not as lights on. Look out for notes to examine for a backstory. Okay, 2011, the 10th of March. I am faced with a great anticipation of the experiment of Phase 2. After my work prisoners during the Cronald War, my talents recognized Lamy in Science Ward of N4 in 2008. After being researched, for the success of flying mutation in rats, a mere dis dissection of a bee. Patient 095 is rotten to me in the coming days. It will be a true success. Living in the ward in solitude makes me uneasy and I have no connection to my family in Russia or outside the world. And the rations of rye bread trigger flashbacks to the war. The steel beds pain my back and I night tears from the war and make my pathetic homosopian brain resist sleep. Though I see it as a blessing, the longer I'm awake. The more advancements I can make in research and the closer I can bring my union to a stronger line of creatures that may create, I may one day get an upgrade to. Non creations that would make the world never forget my name. Evgeny uh, Elikian Odeng. Is that a key? Yeah, that is a key. I guess we backtrack. One unknown causes here appear at the facility for some time. Yeah, this is the end. Oh no, there's more. What the hell? Yeah, there's way more. Here, is this key fin the door over here? No. Another Soviet cap? Our Soviet had, except this one looks a military of sorts. It must have been a massive project created by Russian government that scientists, doctors, and military personnel alike. Soviet base in America. Hey. So what's this? Door is locked. Nothing else? Whoa. Be locked. D. Duh. I don't know. Oh, block, block, block. <laughs> uh, the same cage contained electrical wiring. I saw the entrance. It's all starting to come together. This was never an attraction. This is a unique facade for a secret facility. Yes, yeah, this, this is block, block. Okay, uh, again now, again now. This is block D, I guess. Bathroom? Yeah, I was everyone like not in here. Rust is beyond belief. The locations in the facility are terrible. Locked again? That goes deeper in. Filled with wood and rubble, they were in the process of building this room without a doubt. This area is massive though. And it's all like... It's not running too hard on my PC. I know some games run super hard with these like type of graphics on my PC, but then again I don't know if they're not like optimized or something. So we got in here, it's cold in here. Oh jackhammer, and I flip the search to turn, nothing happens. Okay. What did that do? Yeah, what? What did that do? So is there a monster in the game or something? Okay, it opened this door. Good thing I, good thing I looked over here because I would have never been able to see this. Fires. Another door. Speaker for the entrance. This is a setup. Maybe used to lure people in to use this game pigs. However, it looks like a long time since anyone has occupied this facility. There's a note over there. Oh, you what? 
Okay, I got a screwdriver. What is this? Oh, a flask. Holy crap. They need generous to Soviets. Base headquarters, Nebraska. Oh dang, what the hell? 2004. Create a new race of efficient soldiers, project of manpower and show strength in new generation of Soviets in the United States. Uh, abandoned sewer tunnel takeover in Nebraska, United States. OCO budget 2030. <clears throat> Base to be built beginning 2005, completed 2009. The government approval. Base 3 set 2014. Mm hmm. Wait, new generation of Soviet federal agents supposed as nice assistance and collect test subjects. Oh, what the hell? Dang, Soviet base in America, bro. What the hell? And it's like they make, they're making new Soviets. This is like some crazy stuff. Phase 3 be limited to Amelia and bacteria. Experience for creating a new system dominant traits, characteristics, and genes. What the hell, dude? Uh, some of sapient cerebrums and target frontal and peripheral lobes. Physical work will include research. In phase one, take full control of sapiens psychologically using neurochip. Oh, dang. What the hell? Dang, neurochip implants. Uh, physical mutations. Physical force will include removal of oculus eyes. What the hell? Removal of eyes. Oh, dang. That's crazy, man. So, is any of these monsters in here? What do I need a screwdriver for? Yeah, what? What's a screwdriver for? Which way do we come out from? Over there. What's the screwdriver for then? Now, these are all locked doors. Yeah, what's the screwdriver for? This is the part where I'm confused, because I didn't see a thing that needed a screwdriver. Yeah. Maybe something in here? I don't know. What? Okay, now I'm confused. What do we have? We have a key? We still have the key though. It looks like it could unlock something. Maybe one of the doors back here? Okay, it opens up the doors here. So I just take it. Oh, I should have took it out and like. Yeah, whatever. Screwdriver, take it out. But what about the other doors back here? I did miss the one door. I don't know if I did it wrong or not. No, that's still locked. I mean, the other one's locked too, right? It won't work. No. Alright. So that's where we need to go. Alright. So, oops. Yeah, we've been in here before. So, take. So, we're gonna be venting here. Also, yeah, what's up with the games? And, like, there's a bunch of games that always have you going through a vent to get to the next area. Alright. Oops. So yeah, what kind of beast lurks inside of here? Because it said like Soviet, you know, a new Soviet soldier, you know. So where are we at now? Whatever lies on the other side of this hatch, I will never know. Yeah. And that, yeah, why is it abandoned too? I still have the screwdriver, so I don't need a key anymore. Tunnels again? Budge. The hell is that? Huh? What is this? I like the thing is breathing, living or not, looks similar to one I saw through the window. Scientists inside gave out the same heat waves. It's breathing? What the hell, bro? What? It's breathing? Oh, dang. Whoa. <laughs> Turn off the lights. <laughs> ah, I, wonder, I wonder what this button does. Yeah. Oh, God. I don't want to turn off the lights, dude. I can't touch it. Yeah, I can't touch it. Okay, good. What's the whole point of this, then? 
I need to turn the power off. Oh god. All right. This is fire. Okay. I need to turn the power off. How do we turn it off? Get to the door. I need to find something to break it or turn the power off if I wish to proceed. Doesn't work. What other game uses this whole like buy temperature thing? I think um, Cyrostasis does that one game, Cyrostasis. I remember right? I haven't played it yet. Powering the red light without being connected to the main power. Oh, yeah, what the hell? I think the game Cyrostasis does this whole like um, wide temperature thing, but I haven't played it. I mean, I, I tried the beginning out because I was gonna do it. I, I wanted to keep it like for you. I don't. I, I want to do like a blind playthrough for my YouTube channel, but I don't know. I know what that game does the whole body temperature thing, but I don't know of any other games. So wait, what? Is there another tunnel to go through here? Yeah, this way, right? Is this somewhere we've really been? Oh, we haven't been here, I don't, I don't think. What's this? Ancient corner, ancient road. Why it was the road to this place? Even the gutter made, made road? These things lying around, you believe otherwise. Rodor? What's that? A key card? Card pen connected to the gate door. Found a key card. Nothing else? So we got a key card, I don't know where else we should go. Or then to one place to cut the power, but I don't know how to cut the power. Try to come in again? Through here? Yeah, it came through the vent here. No reason to go back, yeah. I didn't miss anything in here, right? So how do I cut the power? It's not as simple as pushing the button. Yeah, it's not as simple as pushing the button, it seems. Oh, budge. That's the only door that will open. I don't know, I guess they hit back. They made a key card to work on the door? I don't know. <clears throat> That's as far as we can go. Is there a keypad? No. There has to be an item in here or something. Or a switch, you know? Seems pretty obvious that it's right here, but we need to we gotta find a way to break this, break it, or turn it off. There's nothing in here that can do that. I don't see anything. Okay, I'm already confused, dude. Here, use the key card to pry your way through. I don't know. I'm really confused at this point. Because we have a key card. There's nothing or, in order for it to go, though. That's the part I'm like, confused about. Oh, wait, I found a door I didn't go into yet. It was like down here. I don't know how I got here, but yeah. I haven't been in here yet. Probably we'll go to key card. Yeah, this is where key card goes. Oh, easy. Huh? So a self point coming here. I don't know. It's a pipe. Oh, it's a button. Oh, it's a button. Oh, 
What? That rose everything up. Now what? What's all fine doing that? Oh, maybe it turned off the power, or at least submerged it. Yeah, here's the one room we went into. I didn't see that door. There's a, another door down there. Whoops. <laughs> oh, maybe it submerged it. Yeah. I don't know. We'll have to see here. But yeah, definitely. This game is pretty interesting so far. What was that? Oh, God. Was that? <laughs> well, not sticking around to find out. I could have stood there and like waited for it to pop around the corner, but I don't know. It's best we. Did, it's best to not know, I guess. Okay, we're here now. Why do I go back? One oh, budge. Surprisingly, all the things are working in facility. Finishing still does. So what does I don't know the music, bro. What the hell? Why did it go back up? I turned it down. Yeah, mu oh my god, dude. Yeah, music is like forcing itself to stay out. Here. Yeah, the music doesn't stay down. <laughs> hey god. Alright, I don't know. Let's see here. Whoa. Lasers. Fuse inside the solar panel with disconnected. I wonder what who had done that and for what reason. A bunch of meat. Can I jump over the lasers? I guess so. All right. If only I had a dollar. Feels like it already. Since I drink a cold cola can. Matter of fact, I got himself predicament. It's the same gold for the entrance. Yeah, I don't think the options for like the volume works, dude. I tried turning it down, but I kept going back up. The tape recorder. Who, uh, according to our diary, I can't find them how this world reacted. Found out about this Russian facility in East Nebraska. Today I'm told the plan we changed and I'm just again transporting bodies. This is this time so we have space to build. Catacombs need to be concealed so the entrance will be transferred to a hard attraction to express any suspicion. Do my job right, we should help lure subjects to attend based on drawing attention to the operation behind the sinister welcome sign. <laughs> just like me. It's uh, kind of ironic how people will be warned through the sign only the hardest they're about to walk into are far more horrific than you can imagine. And even so, body storage will definitely overdo and should really increase the efficiency of the project. As I write, they're taking down the lights to replace the candles. It's coming along as a planned. Dang, bro. Deal with baking soda, food storage. What's in here? Oh, rotting meat. A lever? Damn, bro. Say there's nothing on Turner Tap, not surprising. Stand here? Lair does nothing when I turn it. Hmm. I was in a camera. It's more modern than the other ones I saw. I've done that for a reason. Well, here we go again. Oh, made it. I'll die if I go through it. Find a way to turn off steam. Is there a lever? 
Oh, what's this? Construction site to just doing construction around a facility, not just a scientist word. Watch when I pull the handle. Coffee dispenser must have been working all night a day. Where'd it even go? Yeah, what? That goes back here. Yeah, what? Where's. Hey, it's coming through in here. I don't see anywhere we could go though. We have a lever to turn something off. Yeah, what? I don't understand. I might be in here. No. What's this? Huh? I opened up the lockers from the other side. Yeah, what? There's nowhere to put this. Huh? I don't know. Oh, it's right here. <laughs> there we go. Jesus. <laughs> it's right here the entire time. Alright, wait for his steam to wear off. Alright, in we go. Huh? Oh my god, there we go. I always have to make their own contraptions for exercise. Hello? Can you hear me? What the hell? Oh, thank the grace of God. I thought I was going to be trapped in this hellhole forever. What? what? <laughs> Who is this guy? Don't worry. I can get us both out of this horrible predicament. But it's not going to be easy. My name is Billy. And I've been trapped behind the thick walls of this cell since the start of the facility's outbreak. If you can find a way to get me out of this cell, I have a key card to the sewer's control room where we can open the hatch to one of the sewer pipes which leads to the outside world. To my knowledge, the sewer pipes are our only exit. We'll keep in touch. Follow the stairs to the labs for now. Dang. Alright, we got a survivor here. Alright, facility outbreak. It's all mean though. Whoa. It's the one thing. I can touch it. It feels organic and extremely hot. However, it doesn't seem it's gonna hurt me. Did you see this experience scientists made? Yeah, I don't wanna touch it, bro. What the hell are you doing feeling it, bro, about this? I'm taking another Soviet cap. Soviet symbols. Uh, see, or yeah, I see it's in the water. I want to go swimming down there. What? Oh, yeah, they're down there too. Bang, bro. So, how's saving working in the game, though? I don't know. If I. It's like, I don't know if a monster chases me down and gets me, do I just go back to the beginning? Hello? I have to be honest with you. I was one of the test subjects. I'm an experiment, but I'm still a damn human. I'm sure by now you've read most of the documents that have been lying around the N4 facility. Yep, I have. The Soviets targeted American civilians to create modern day slaves in order to conquer the US. Dang, bro. I became one of their guinea pigs. Dang. One night, I was walking home after going to the store when an unmarked police car pulled up on the side of me. People dressed like federal agents hopped out and told me to get in the car or they'd shoot me. Hey, what? I was drugged and then woke up in a small dark room. First was the psychological experiments. Trying to get rid of my empathy and emotion. <gasps> then came the medicine. Trying to get rid of my pain and suppress my nerves. Hmm. Then came... Then came the physical experiments. 
I was the first human test subject they successfully crossed DNA with. My hands grew into long claws. My teeth grew fangs. I had a wife and kids before this. <laughs> Don't be scared. I'm just like you. I won't hurt anybody. <laughs> we must escape sure and expose that? Russia for the genocide they have done to the American people. If you leave info without me, nobody will believe you. I have a ca fuck the ca camera. How are you seeing Sar not good contain what's ever inside? Another one? This one's still resisting heat or making noise. Is it still alive? Was it ever alive? Whoa. <laughs> See if that does anything to them. I guess not. I can walk on it. Okay. Producing heat and moving store to other ones. Is it dead? Sledgehammer? Can I take it? No? This boy says he has long claws, man. I'm still human though. Don't worry about, don't worry about the fangs. <laughs> oh, whoa, missiles! I'm t t we had solely an agent's ability to mass themselves as U.S. citizens and offer silly, too good to be true jobs to civilians. Shocking my people, they think can get into real estate. Just following a man in a suit to our office, not to mention stress. Sure, our agents remain on those for forcing civilians to our cars. Nothing more than guns is the best option. Brings piles of idiots who wouldn't be missed right up to our door, protecting the secrecy of the operation. To make this become reality, we spent countless months conducting a road that took drivers off course straight to our attraction. She implemented it was time to turn on the radio frequencies and run out of GPS. Most of the we could brainwash the victim to sit in their car until the gas was fully drained. Dang, what the heck? Your chip things? Without a new chip, a person would have to enter the attraction on their own free will. However, it's no other option. They have no choice but to enter, thus be kidnapped and be taken straight to the labs. The hard attraction appearance is simply a facade for any American organization or nosy pigs trying to sniff around too much. Dang, bro. Another key card. Dang, check out these missiles. These are actually Soviets ready to go to war. Holy moly. Goes through here. Whoa. Oh my god, there's a lot of reading here. Intense Proprov? Brainwashed mutant test subjects. Nurse failures in phase to conclude that brainwashing a patient to be used to a light Jewish ass state down. <laughs> a new chance of entering a place was simulated by frequencies when you place a pig. Extreme amount of love and compassion to the animal. Remain stimulated. He began to dismember the pig. Oh dang. So experiments. Wait, what's to say about that? If one of the subjects goes past its base, leaking into existence of the facility to the public, throwing on top of the staff member and sleep causing suffocation. Unreal, when I press on the buttons, the blue screen of death is displayed on the monitor. Bacteria from phase one experience grows limbs, I presume. Huh. The camera. The camera is in this place because that's the entrance is located. Oh. That goes deeper in though. Was there any more? Wait, go back. If I go back here, there's still like a lot more. So we need a password. Okay, so I was wondering what was over here. So I guess we just head back now. Oh, is he in here? Yeah, it's the one boy in here. H? Another camera? 
H E H E A E. We're clean off this time. Yeah, it's heat. That's what the That's what the one thing is, sort of code. So now we gotta head back. Whoa. What? Is that the thing in the monitor human? So the code is heat. All right. What? Oh, that's M. Whoops. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> I, I thought that the M looked like an H. Okay. They are going further in. Dang, pretty spooky game so far, not gonna lie, bro. You never know what's good. That's like you never know what's, what's gonna happen or what to expect. Where's this boy? Oh, tell me, is this him? Stealthy? Put away a dull stick? Stealthy. So big the glass broke despite the glass thickness. Stealthy? And did the power box? Door is stuck, busting in the skies. Whoa. Where are we going? <laughs> What's that? Dude. What the hell? Bruh. Alright, how, how am I supposed to see it if it's pitch black in here? What the hell was that? Dude. You guys see that? Oh, yo. Horse. Ah! Oh my god. <laughs> I'm gonna do this if I if I'm getting chased by this boy, bro. <laughs> what the hell? What the hell, dude? Oh my god, bro! <laughs> oh, he's coming! He's out there, guys. What the hell? I can't see him if it's pitch black, bro. in here Bro, there's nothing in here. Absolutely zero things in here. Oh great, where is he? No, it's not where I need to be. What's this? Oh, it's under. I want to find out what's underneath the tarp. This seems to be worse than mine. What's this? What are I doing here? What computer room? Ah, okay. <laughs> I see if I saw him or something. Oh 
my god, bro. <laughs> you don't even hear him walk around, either. What am I supposed to do in here? Let's... <laughs> You don't even hear him. He just sneaks up on you, bro. It's like, what? What am I supposed to do? I don't even not see anything in here that would, like, benefit me in any way. Why are you freezing, bro? What the hell? Uh, there's a saw on the bottom card. Just uh, couldn't have done this. Could, could they? Bathroom? That oh, boy is freezing, bro. What the hell? Oh. We're hiding. What's this? Hey, get up! Oh, God. <laughs> Am I collecting fuses? What the hell is this? Huh? Yeah, what? Yeah, that's why he sneaks up on you, dude. What am I collecting fuses for? Yeah, what? What? Four fuses. I need four fuses? Those things are so small though. Bruh. It's probably in the rooms, right? Yeah. Gosh, I gotta go in here with this boy, bro. Running around. They're so small though. That's a thing. Or if I knocked it over in my like panic when I was running away, I don't know. One here, dude. My guy is freezing, bro. Yeah, this is my boy freezing. What the hell? Ah, there he is. He's right there. Oh shit. Yeah, I have a fuse in here. Dude, I'm almost dead. Where are other fuses at? Bro, I hate it. I hate fighting items, especially when they're tiny as hell, dude. I can't see crap in here, bro. Oh, it's in here, it's in here. It's right here. You get it. Here, we got it. That's everything. That's everything, guys. We got all the fuses. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Alright, in we go. There we go. Alright, now we go. Jesus, alright. Ah, oh, man. This game, bro. I think this game is like roughly like two hours long, if I remember right. I'm so sorry. I, I, I didn't know there were test subjects still in the labs. I understand why you're scared. But I'm in a cell, and I haven't seen what the rest of the facility looks like since the start of the outbreak. I only know about the exit through the sewer pipes because 
I saw one of the doctors escaping through there during the outbreak before moving me into a different cell. We're almost together. My cell is in the underground tunnels. You're only one door away. Dang, Find a way right. to switch back on the power, because without it, you're going to be stuck in that room just like I am I in this room. What happened? Oh, we got whacked. Now what the hell? <laughs> huh? What's going on? God. Where are we? Yeah, what the hell? What happens if... I don't know, I'm just curious. How the load system is in this game, or like, if the game actually saved. <laughs> load. Okay, so there's like the chapters here. So if I do that, that means I get back to the one area. Let's see here. Yeah, where is this? What the hell? Is that Nightbird trying to tell me something? Yeah, what? I don't know. But other than that, guys, I should have went through it. Okay, whatever. But other than that, guys, that's the video of Nebraska for for now. And next video, um. I guess it'll be like the final part of this spooky series. Yeah, I wasn't in, even in a nightmare. <laughs> this like if you quit and load. This takes you like two, I don't know, after the thing. Which is weird. So we got like a few more after this, alright. Other than that guys, that's Nebraska for now. Subscribe to see you next part whenever it comes out. And I'll see you guys next video. Alright, it's time for me to go.